A local woman was in Haiti visiting her parents who are missionaries when the catastrophic earthquake hit. Now she's telling her dramatic story about survival and asking others to help the nation in this time of need. SNN Local News 6 reporter Grant Boxleitner has more on this. We thought it was the end of the world and any minute the house would fall. Sarasota resident Tammy Combs was at her parents' house in Haiti when the massive earthquake struck. We heard what sounded like a freight train coming from a distance and um, all of a sudden the house was shaking and, and rocking and moaning. Combs said the tremor seemed to never end. When it was finally over, the landscape had forever changed. All of a sudden the whole city was covered in this white cloud and um, we just heard from, from our house, way up in the mountains, we just heard wailing and screaming. And Combs' husband Andrew is an officer at the Sarasota Police Department and was with her during the earthquake. Once it ended, she says he helped in the search for survivors. He's just trying to um, get back into life and I don't know if he's got post-traumatic stress or anything going on, but he's... He's dealing with it a lot better than us girls are. Combs' brother is a pilot for Venice-based Agape Flights, which provides assistance to missionaries in Haiti. Agape helped her after the quake. Now she's asking people here to help Agape. I never realized how important they were till now when I was down there desperate and how um, when they let the plane land, it, it brings us supplies and food and, and we can give that to other people also. And now she's just thankful to be back home. I'm very happy to be alive. I'm, I'm very fortunate that my family is alive and my heart goes out to the people that are there. I, I'm still there with them. It feels like I haven't left yet. Reporting in Sarasota County, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News 6. If you'd like information about helping Agape Flights, you can go to their website at agapeflights.com.